Hello and welcome to the Daily Guidance for Friday, December 2nd. We are already in December, full swing Sagittarius season. And honestly, I feel like with Sagittarius, it's, it's actually mutable fire. So it's like action that you take at a mature space. Oh, wow. Yeah. So that's why the action in the masculine keeps coming up. Okay. It's like things are coming to me as I'm sit and really feel it. So yeah, it's mutable fire. It's the most evolved fire sign. So it's going to take mature action. It's not going to be impulsive. It's not going to be fixed and unchangeable. It's going to be open. Masculine action. Okay, I see. It's coming together. It's reviewing everything. It's taking a wide perspective, actually. Sagittarius, ruled by Jupiter. Expansion. Um, travel. Oh, wow. Yeah. Openness. All right. This is what we get here. The answers you need are coming. Answers. If you're looking for answers, they're around you. I feel like you've already gotten it, but you got to sit and hone in on it, right? Anything else. The answers are here, okay? The answers are here. I want to get angel answers next. And actually, the answers you need are coming. I feel like angel answers is going to is going to give you the answers, okay? All right. Meditation brings answers. <laughs> you got to meditate. So the answers are already within you. And as you meditate, that's when you get it. This is so funny. <laughs> I think that um, they have a sense of humor today. <laughs> you want the answers? You, you got to sit and let it come to you. It's already within you. Okay. That's what that's saying. And I feel, okay. I guess that's why they wanted me to use those two first. The answers are already here. Let's see what we get with Energy Oracle. And I just remembered what it was I wanted to do. You know how when you want to do something and then you go into the room that you want to do that thing in and then it leaves you and you forget. Like, I just remembered there's something I wanted to do. <laughs> you know, if I don't write it down, I'm not going to remember. But you know what? It'll come to me again. All right. Uh, strategy. There's a strategy that you can encompass, right? Actually, there's a compass here. It'll give you direction. It's going to lead you to a certain location. Uh, there's a strategy journaling. Some of you go back to the 21st of a month. And what did you write on that day? There's some answers there. Okay. The garden in the gate. Uh, some of y'all got to get the hell out of the garden. Wherever you think it's all rosy and and plush and comfortable. You're going to have to get the hell out of there. Okay. I'm, I'm just going to give y'all a message today. All right. Let's see. First chakra. Yep. Yeah, your fears. You got to face your fears. All right. Come on with it. They come in with it. They see I'm in a mood. Yeah. Then it might leave you heartbroken. It might break other people's heart. Um, Things need to be done. That's the strategy. For some of y'all, that's the answer. The cold hard truth, there you, you have it right there. Okay. Let's see if we get anything here. Oh, these cards are asking for me to grab them. This one failed. Message of concern. So this is something, some of y'all, is going to bring concern to someone. What is going on? Something's happening. I don't know. I feel like something just happened. Um, let, me, let me keep going. Here. Wealthy man, sudden wealth. 
This is interesting because, oh my God. Um, this is for somebody. I think I know what this means. You you got to aim high and shoot. And it's like, yes, it may hurt. It may cause pain. There may be some fear around this. Um, <laughs> there's a specific person here. I think they're giving an answer right now. Anything else? So there's there's something that happens after this, after you're able to get out of the garden. This is a strategy. Um, somebody's journal entry, yes. The 21st or the 12th. The 21st, really. Um, yeah, there's a message of concern. It's going to put you on another journey. So it came back out. Whatever this is, it will bring. It's going to cause a ruckus for certain people. Man, oh man. I'm getting a message here. I feel like this is going to be for those of you who it's for. This is not everybody's message. It's time for change. We're getting these butterflies again. It's time for change. There's butterflies here. And she got butterflies all over her. Um, it's, it's transformation time. This is the number five card. This is the answer for somebody. Nature is calling you. So, spending time outside, meditating outside, if you usually meditate inside, meditate outside. I feel like you're going to get more psychic hits like that. Live in the world as a dreamer and create a future paradise. This is you living your dream. The wealthy man in sudden wealth. Some of you have not tapped into your true potential yet. Uh, some of you have to realize what's waiting for you. It's like you you want to start dreaming and allow your dreams to come true. Right. Wealthy man, sudden wealth. That's somebody's dream. This is a message. I'm um, feeling it stronger than I can articulate it. Okay. This feels kind of... Um, this feels like it's been waiting for somebody to do something, right? Like this, this is going to be somebody's overnight success, right? It's going to be a huge surprise. Okay, there's somebody listening who has accumulated a certain amount of spiritual currency. Oh gosh. There's somebody. You're you are a good person. You're a good person, but for some reason you feel unlucky because you watch everything good happen for others. And as you give and give and give and give, people take, take, take. People take you for granted they do you wrong and it almost feels like you always always gets you get the short end of the stick now you're giving that is not unnoticed it's not unnoticed they see you you're being watched somebody's going to be like an overnight success an overnight millionaire or something like you are wealthy all the giving that you give it's going to come back to you it's going to come back to you in a sudden way now um 
you can't forget though, because I feel like you're working in it from a low, like um, the vibrational space that you are is very low. They can't give you your abundance unless you face your fears and stop working from a place of hurt and pain. So it's like you are the one that's going to be delivering this message of concern. It's going to require you to do something brave. There's a strategy, strategy to you accumulating your wealth. Well, for you to see it manifest into the 3D, there's some kind of message you need to deliver. And in this message, I see you traveling. I see you leaving something. I see you packing your bags and leaving. So this is like walking away from the life that you know. Oh, okay. They just told me this is to be shared on YouTube. Um, all right. This is somebody's message. I feel this is specific. A star. Okay, I'm seeing a star, so I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means something to someone. There's a star here. Um, a watch. Okay. We're going to get tarot. There's some kind of answer they're trying to get out here for somebody. If you're, okay, so if you are somebody that there's something you want to do, there's something you want to communicate, but you know it's going to hurt a lot of people or it may just hurt a person that you love. And this is the scariest thing. This is the scariest thing for you. And okay, I see. All right, um, let's get some tarot. They're wanting you to live in the world as a dreamer. Allow your dreams to come true. It's like once you're able to face whatever this fear is, you're going to be living your dream life here. Meditate. This is going to require y'all to. Um, there's going to be some changes that come. Once you communicate whatever it is they're trying to get you to communicate, there's going to be some major changes. I see you moving. I see you in a different life, actually. And that's going to bring even more conflict because what the life you're leaving... Oh, wow. I see. We have multiple cards. Okay, the Wheel of Fortune. This is destiny. This is something that's destined to happen. So this tells me it's going to happen. It's time for it to happen. Okay, yeah, it's time for it to happen. It's time for change. So it's time to make this change. The wheel is turning. Um... Put your fears behind you. Yeah. Some this is someone who you're 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 moving on to a, a person, another person. Somebody has encountered a divine counterpart, and it's gonna require them to leave a certain situation. This is a destined union. What God brings together, let no man tear apart. That's what I'm getting. This is destined. This is a union, a divine union. Somebody's sudden wealth comes in when this connection happens. Wow. Death at the bottom. Death. 
there's this is a major transformation so somebody this somebody's answer okay anything else if nothing falls that's it but that's um what i'm getting okay so that's it y'all the world the cycle is over it's complete it's final this is the message all right, I'm gonna actually leave it there. And then I'm about to move into recording these Zodiac sign readings. And they already told me, Gemini, I'm gonna be doing Gemini and then Scorpio. And then I'll see where they lead me after that. Ooh, baby. Okay, that's your message. I hope this was helpful. I'll see y'all on Monday, have a good weekend. And, um, yeah, meditate. They want you to meditate outside. There's some answers coming to you here. Okay. It's time for change, y'all. All right. Have a good weekend. I'll see you on Monday.